Hey, what's going on guys? Prelu here, and welcome to a regular commentary for you guys here today. Um, and yeah, sorry about not uploading a, a videos the past two days. I've just been, I've been a little bit busy and a little bit lazy. I, uh, I, uh, I usually record, um, one or two videos, uh, on certain days when I don't really have that much to do, but this time I kind of forgot, so yeah, hopefully I can get one or, hopefully I can, uh, hopefully I can at least get one video for you guys, uh, today, but I'm gonna try and get two, so I'll uh, be on the lookout for the other one, or if the other one came before this one, then, yeah, but, um, yeah, obviously this is Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, um, this is not really a review, I'm um, just gonna be more of a first impressions, or... A kind of my opinion of the game so far and a little bit about the gameplay before I get into that this is my second ever gameplay after my first advanced warfare upload which was that was my first gameplay this was literally the game after if you guys can watch that you guys can just go you know you, you guys can literally just go down into the previous video or or um I'll just I'll just put it down in the you know in the in the looking I'll just put it down in the link <sighs> fucking you Kelly, shut up! Alright, yee! What's going on, guys? Brilu here. Welcome back to some more Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Uh, this is going to be a bit more of a regular... Com this, is this is going to be regular commentary today. Um, so, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, sorry about not uploading a video yet. Uh, two days ago. Um, you know, yesterday and... You know, sorry for not uploading videos the past two days uh i've been kind of a little bit busy and a little bit lazy i usually record one or two videos on certain days when i don't have that much to do but i just kind of forgot and whatnot so hopefully i can get one or at least two videos out today for you guys um so be on the lookout for that and uh yeah this is gonna be more of a first impressions than a uh than a review uh it's gonna be like a first impression or kind of my opinion of call of Duty advanced warfare and um, just a little bit about this gameplay. Uh, this is literally this, the the gameplay right after the, um, my first video on Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. This is literally the second gameplay, my second gameplay ever on Advanced Warfare, or the one that came after. Um, and yeah, if you guys didn't watch that, then I'll I'll just put a li I'll just put a link down in the description in the description below, or or you guys can just you know look on the previous video. Um, either or. Um, but uh, yeah, I think I do fairly well. But you guys can be, um, you guys can be a judge of that. Um, this, uh, I guess I'll, I guess I'll start with the positives first. Um, I'm just gonna say right off the bat, I do really enjoy this game. I mean, I like every Call of Duty, but this game is just there's the exo movements, in my opinion, just like like this game actually is feels this game actually it feels like Call of Duty, but it it has. It, it, it actually is different compared to all the, it, you know how people are crying about Call of Duty not changing. This Call of Duty is actually different. If you want a different Call of Duty, if you want to actually want to play one that's different, then this is it. This is your Call of Duty. Um, so it's kind of cool. And for all the old people that are like, oh, this isn't Call of Duty. It it is. And if it's not, then you can just play the classic mode, which kind of ruins, kind of doesn't ruin it, but it's not as fun as this as regular with exo movements. Um, but if you want to, you still can. But if you if you don't, then don't just don't play this one. Just play Black Ops 2 or Ghost. But um, yeah. So yeah, the positives. Uh, the extra movements is amazing. I love just being able to boost dodge and boost jump everywhere. It it actually has a skill gap to Call of Duty now. Um, there actually is somewhat of a skill gap to Call of Duty. Like you can tell if yeah, here's a little pissed. But um, you can actually tell the difference between someone who isn't good at this game and who is good like you can just you can actually dodge people camping in the corner you can actually like you know just like like there's so many times there's a couple of times where i just outplayed people just because of the exo abilities and it's just it's awesome to have that i just love being able to you know some guy sees me i just love being able to jump on top of a building or just boost dodge sideways out of the way it's so it's just it's neat it's cool it's just awesome uh the gun balance is okay uh i'm gonna get more to that in i guess the negative section but um it's more of an AR dominant game, so I, I that's kind of good. I like that because I'm. If you guys didn't know, I'm more of an eight. I'm more of a assault rifle um, player. I like assault rifles more. Um, I just I just enjoy them more. Uh, if you're if you're an SMG uh, player, the SMGs are okay, but assault rifles are just more dominant and just better in this game. Um, 
And uh, yeah, the maps, the maps, pl the maps are really, w the maps are uh, well. There's no, um, you know, like sovereign, or it's not a sovereign, but there's no like siege, stone, Stonehaven, or Stormfront. You know, like those crazy ass huge maps. Or there's no, there's no real bad maps. There's a couple map, there's a couple maps that I don't like, um, but that's just cause like, that's just cause like this, um, this couple stuff is just like the spawns are really hectic on them. Um, Overall, the maps are really good. Um, it's really, it's uh, it's it's really cool. I like what they did with them, especially especially how with the exo movements, they 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 kind of made the maps specifically because you have the exo movements now, so it's kind of cool. Um, but yeah, overall, it's just a really good game. It still has that Call of Duty feel to me, and just the exo movements is just a nice, fresh of breath air for Call of Duty, and it's just, it's just it's just it's neat to play. A little bit let's play Call of Duty, but for it to be actually like you know a little bit different. Um, and now I'm kind of go, I'm kind of go, I'm kind of switch. I'm, I'm gonna switch over to the negatives. Um, one, two, two really, really glaring bad, badly negative things on here are the spawns. The spawns are just horrible. Not horrible, but like. Oh my god, I don't know, I guess it's the spawns and the fact that you have exo movements because, so now you can like, you can, you can traverse from A to B, like I love that, I love how you can, you can just traverse the entire map from A to B just really quickly, but, it, it I don't know if that's the reason why the spawns are bad, but like, you'll literally kill a guy and like, you spawn, he'll spawn right behind your butthole or something, like, it's, the spawns are bad, I mean to be fair, the spawns are bad in every Call of Duty, like, Black Ops 2, I'm not sure if you guys remember, but Black Ops 2, Ghosts. The spawns were really bad in there too. Um, you know, Moth for three. You know, Bla Black Ops one had decent one, had decent spawns. But um, um, it's just I I don't know why they can't make good spawns in a Call of Duty. It's been out for what seven eight years and they can't. They still can't make a good call. I get it, the mass is small and whatnot, but you can't make it. I don't know. It's just it's weird to me. Um, the lag is really bad too. I don't know if it's only. PC apparently it's a little bit better, but apparently Xbox Ones and PS4 you will never stay on a constant connection. You it will always be switching between a four bar and a one bar. I don't know what where the hell is. I don't know why it's so laggy right now. Um, but that's really bad. There's so many times where I just I was lost gunfights because of lag. Um, and the time to kill is a little bit too fast. I feel it's a little bit. It's similar. It's it, this game is similar to Ghost and Black Ops 2. It's really similar to Black Ops 2 in gun in in gameplay and kind of like you know the pick ten system and all that. And I did pretty good there, 27-5. Um, um, but but yeah, uh, I feel like it's a little bit too fast, um, too 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 quick. Like uh, it's a little bit like like the gameplay and all this and all that is like you know the 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 pick thirteen system and score streaks is like Black Ops 2, but the time to kill is a little bit fast, like ghosts, and adding the exo movements, um, it does kind of slow the time to kill a little bit. Like it's a little bit harder to, I guess, hit people, attract people. But it, I feel like, I feel like if they bumped up the health a little bit, um, it would be, it would be a bit, it would be, you know, a better game. Um, and yeah, sorry, I just, I, I had a little bit more I wanted to talk about, but um, the game, the game kind of ended and. Um, yeah, so yeah, that's, that's pretty much, yeah, so this is the second game, uh, this is, this is, uh, I think from yesterday, actually, I'm, this is, I mean, the last gameplay that I showed, I was level, like, 8 or something, this one I'm level, like, 40 something, like, I'm closer to what I am, I'm level 45, I think, I'm just 5 more, 5 levels away from prestiging, um, yeah, and I do feel, and another negative, I do feel like the SMG should get buffed a little bit, they're a little bit, too weak. The uh, I say the the top three guns in this game are the, the Bal with 27, which is a lot. Lots of people say it's you know like the best gun. The Bal, the, the HBR A3, and the AK-12. Those are the best guns. Those are the guns I, I recommend that you use. SMGs are just they're really good up close, but just like um, the range of some of these maps that you're playing, it's it's kind of yeah. But yeah, we're playing Uplink, and it's a really fun game mode. If if you haven't played it, I really suggest you you play it. It's kind of like basketball with guns and like, um, there's a ball in the middle and you have to like go and run up and score to the other enemy team's kind of portal thing. 
Uh, you can either throw it in for one point and dunk it in for two. And uh, I joined in this game here, and I'm pretty sure I'm playing against a couple of my friends. Uh, I've normally played this game mode with friends, and they were playing, and I joined in on the opposite team. And uh, you guys will get to see what happens. Um, it's kind of fun. But uh, yeah, that's kind of my, I guess, first impressions. And I feel like this game is... This game is really like Black Ops 2, especially in the beginning. I... I, um... My... I, I had the same experience in this. Not the same experience, but I have similar experience to this in Black Ops 2 as I do with Advanced Warfare right now. I feel like... I feel like everyone else has an has a, is a has a really has a much better shot than than uh than me or not me but like a solar has a dominant right like and the mass are kind of big I feel like like the guns have really similar the guns are really similar to Black Ops Two in that now I don't even ha I don't really have a gun that I find the best like I like the bow but like I can't I feel like I can't hit medium to long shots. And that's the same problem I have in Black Ops 2. I can't, I feel like medium and long range kills, I, I just can't really hit that well. Everyone else can kill me faster at those ranges, but I can't kill them for some reason. And, um, yeah, it was really weird when this game first came out, like, at launch. On the first day, I was, I was, a, I was, I was an amazing but like, I went, what, I went 14 and something on the very first game, like you guys saw, and then I went 27. And six on the, the, the game previous to the one I'm showing right now, and I was pretty much doing that. I played. I haven't. I didn't play for. I only played. I played less than an hour on the very first launch day, but like, I felt like I was doing really good. And everyone, I, I, I guess I had grasped the exo movement faster than everyone else. But then the next day when I came back on, everyone else was like, everyone else had learned how to play really well or something. And it was, it was really weird, and um. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please leave a like, subscribe, comment, and we'll see y'all in the next one. Peace. And um, yeah, I don't know. I just, I just, if you, especially if you haven't played Call of Duty in a while, I really suggest you you play it. Uh, I really suggest you get this game. It's really cool. It's really fun. It's different. And uh, we'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.